Hello, I'm Gabriel, account manager at Shining3D. Today we are in our office in Stuttgart with our Einscan HX. And as you may know, the Einscan HX is a hybrid scanner with structured light and laser. We are gonna scan this aluminum part, but first of all, we have to stick markers on it. That should take uh, more or less five minutes. So let's go for it. Okay, stick the markers on the part. It took less than five minutes. So for now, we are going to choose our laser, laser scan mode, create a new project. We create a new project that is called part one. And for this kind of object, we are going to choose now, just to give you an overview, a 0.4 millimeters uh, resolution. So we apply. Okay, and with the new project already created. So you can see we have different options. Our project group list, our scanning settings. You can scan the global market files to have the point reference, save it before scanning. And we can choose uh, the um, different objects, normal, reflective, and black. And that will affect how uh, the laser behaves on the part. So for that case, we are going to choose normal. We are going to start the preview. We can directly on the scanner zoom in or zoom out and we can directly as well adjust the brightness. So if the distance is correct, we see on the left side of the screen is green. That means that we are at the right distance. We just click play and start to scanning.
Okay, so this is the final result. Uh, of course, on the post-processing, we can apply some mesh optimization, a smooth, uh, close some holes, and depending on the application that we are going to, to need after the scanning. And as well, we can share the data on another software and save the STL file. Okay, as you can see, the whole process took 10 to 15 minutes, uh, having the part, put the markers on it, start the scanning, and have the STL file. If you have any, any doubt about the Einscan HX or other of our products, uh, just do not hesitate on, on contact us at uh, sales at shining3d.com. Visit our website, einscan.com. I hope that you find uh, this video useful and thank you very much for watching.